You are now listening to the homily of Father McGowan, priest and member of the Scaled Carmelite Order. This service is provided by the Lexio Divina team, part of the LOV Verbum Day Ministry, who invites you all to share this reflection and their love for the Word of God. The Gospel is the good news of salvation for mankind. That salvation is only through Jesus Christ. As Peter said, Lord, to whom shall we go? You alone have the words of eternal life. Greetings to all who are listening, especially to the Love Verbum Day family members. The Gospel today is from John chapter 10 verses 11 to 18. Today we read in the Gospel about Christ as the Good Shepherd. Today is also Vocation Sunday when the whole church prays for vocations. The two are linked, the Good Shepherd and vocations. All of us are called to be like Christ, whether we are priests, nuns, fathers, mothers, children, single or married. All of us are called by God for a purpose. That is the meaning of vocation, to be called. Among the multitude of vocations, there is one specific and rare vocation that is to priesthood and religious life. Those few who receive this vocation are called to imitate Christ, the Good Shepherd, in a special way. Christ, as a Good Shepherd, is prepared to lay down his life for his sheep. And the priest, or religious, is called to do the same. And you can see in the church today that there are priests and nuns who have done just this. Every year, scores of priests and nuns and brothers uh, lay down their lives for their people. They are our heroes. So it is not a call that one takes lightly, but it is God who calls we respond. It is God who gives us the courage to be like him. I did not always want to be a priest. I was 25 before I made this awesome decision. Before that, I had thought I would get married. It wasn't for lack of trying. But God called me to serve him in this way. Not that I saw it so clearly in those terms. I had been unhappy in my job for years. I thought about what I could do instead, do something I would be good at. Whatever I was to do in the future, it had to be with people. I had come to love serving people. Then one day I realised that I could do this as a priest. What a wonderful grace that was and is. Among the many things I have been grateful for as a Carmelite, one of them has been the opportunity to travel, to visit other countries, to learn their language and culture, to Italy, Spain, Israel, Palestine, and Malawi. What a blessing that has been. I was blessed to spend almost five years in Jerusalem, to live in the land where Jesus the Good Shepherd lived, to be in the city where he both died and rose again. I have a wooden statue of the Good Shepherd I bought in Bethlehem. It's on my bedside table. It's a reminder to me of those wonderful years, but also that he is looking after me because he loves me. And again, 
a reminder that I too am called to be a good shepherd. Next year, I shall be celebrating 40 years of priesthood. It is my prayer that others will also respond to this special way to the calling of God, to be good shepherds, to love people by serving them. With hand on heart, I can say it is the best job in the world. May Almighty God bless you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lexio Divina team hopes that this homily has helped you to deeply welcome the Word of God and gave you the strength to put the Word into practice where you are. You can send us your prayer intentions by emailing them to us using the following email address lov underscore verbum dei v-e-r-b-u-m-d-e-i at outlook.com The Wednesday prayer group gathering at 6.30pm UK time and Father McGowan will pray particularly for these prayer intentions. If this homily has enlightened or touched you in any way, please share it with your relatives, friends, community and on social media. Have a blessed week.